So Gaffer, I guess despite results probably not what be what we would have wanted obviously in recent games, there'll be that desire and, and hunger to get out on Saturday to, to presumably try and you know right a few wrongs. Yeah, there's got to be Mark. Um, you know, we've had a lot of criticism and rightly so over the last uh, few performances. Certainly the last half an hour at Rotherham the other night wasn't acceptable. The players accept that and know that. We watched the game back again. Um, probably one of the most disappointing, certainly the last 30 minutes since I've been uh, in charge. And we've got to turn it round, we've got to do it quickly. Uh, but these are the same players that went to Wigan and Peterborough and Portsmouth and Shrewsbury and won the games and put some great performances in at home. Um, and we will do it again, and we can do it again. But it's it's now time for actions and not words. I know, you know, we can't guarantee a, a result on Saturday, but the players and myself can guarantee a performance full of fight, desire, commitment. We're up against the Wimbledon side who are you know, renowned for that at the moment, they're scrapping for the lives down at the bottom, got a great work ethic. And we've got to match that and, and more, um, first and foremost. The players, you know, understand, you know, they're, they're, they're under fire a little bit, as we all are, but it's now time for, as I say, you know, showing what we're made of. Now, you know, football, you have highs and lows, you have blips, it's how quickly you can come out of them. At the moment, yeah, we're certainly lacking in confidence, that's natural. The players, a lot of them, are not performing, you know, to what they were early on in the season or at the best. But you've just got to find a way in yourself. It comes from inside. You've got to find a way to be be the best you can be. And by doing that, also help your teammate. And, you know, that's what the lads will be striving to do. They haven't become bad players overnight. Yeah, we've had a couple of really disappointing performances, no getting away from that, and poor results. Um, and I take full responsibility for that. But come Saturday, we've got to turn this game into a cup tie. I don't often appeal to fans because our fans have been superb home and away since I've been here and I've been for years and years. But for this one game, I would really appeal to them to come out and give us the commitment that the players are going to show as well. Now I get certain supporters get frustrated and aggrieved and if they don't see the fight you know, for the club and I, I understand totally that. But on Saturday, which always should be a given for me anyway, but regardless of a little lack of confidence or lack of form, you cannot you know, get outworked, outfought, outrun on Saturday. It just cannot be tolerated and won't be accepted and the players know that as well and are fully behind everything. We had a clear the air meeting on Wednesday, mm. went through certain things, we've still got everything to play for, we're still in a position where we can make it a successful season and I believe that. I said seven days ago we'll be stronger in the next couple of weeks, again 100% that will be the case with people coming back from injury and certainly three or four if not more new surfaces coming into the building and, and we'll be ready to go but we've got to get back on track on Saturday and put a performance in. Um, that shows to everyone how much we care and how much it means to us to, to play and manage this club. Um, as I say, there's no guarantees of a result. We need one, but we'll be doing everything um, commitment-wise to get that result.